hey guys what's up and welcome back to my channel my name is austin becca i'm so glad to have you guys here if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly click on subscribe button before you leave also give this video a very big thumbs up right now or at the end if you enjoyed watching it okay guys let me tell you a lot of things have been happening in biggie's house since the whole swapping thing you know since deji moved to the level two mansion and groovy moved to the level one mansion it's just been a lot a lot okay i mean one of the things that i've noticed with both housemates that moved is the fact that you you know both of them are just taking our time to download the recent happenings in the house i mean for example they had a conversation with fina where they were talking about the whole you know they get chairman they get chairman of course you guys remember that particular task where chomzy was upset that you know fina had said they get chairman they get chairman and she was now beefing fina so they kind of talked about things and you know they was like oh we all thought that you said they get chairman and she was like what would i even gain by saying they get chairman so they kind of cleared the air there and just a lot more conversations you know with the the recent happenings and even things that happened in the past you know with the level one and the level two and they just telling them see the game just started okay a lot is going to happen blah 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 and amaka was really invested in this conversation she's like mm, what do you mean by a lot tell me about it blah 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 you know they talked a lot and you guys will remember that as soon as big brother said that groovy was going to the level one mansion fina cried and ocean like fina was literally wailing but then it was just really interesting to see that she was having a conversation with deji uh amaka fam savvy in the room and she was like see at the end of the day it's all a game i talk i'm in the afternoon say groovy go reach everybody say for her now you don't reach out at least say she don't kiss you know she don't press press they don't press and they don't touch out so at the end of the day for her you know she has enjoyed her own moment so if groovy feels like it's okay to move to the level one mansion and you know have something to do with anybody else maybe chomzy and all of that then that's up to him last last groovy go reach everybody what did i talk before i, I said groovy go at reach everybody at least i don't kiss so i'm like okay fina is actually aware that this is all a game so why did she have to cry so much i mean i know that she likes the guy but then the tears were just a lot i'm just like madam relax relax we don't even know if he's going to be gone for that long a part of me actually feels like all these swapping things is just up until sunday and i feel like biggie's probably going to even merge all the housemates together to be honest if you ask me i feel like that's what biggie wants to do on sunday especially because the last post that they made you know where they had all the housemates together they did not particularly differentiate it by saying level one and level two the way big brother would normally separate them this one it was just you know all the housemates together and the caption read level up or nothing else you know so i'm just like hmm hmm big is it this sunday you want to actually merge these housemates together so that the game can start proper and i was having a conversation with one of my friends and she was telling me oh how you know they might even close the second channel you know the extra channel they might just close it and then we might have you know just one channel to focus on now i don't know how true all of that is but i know for sure that big brother has a lot up his sleeves and you know as time goes on we're definitely going to find out what they are but for sure this sunday eviction this sunday life eviction is going to be a lot and guys you don't even want to miss it for anything of course i always go live on my instagram page during the sunday life eviction show so feel free to tune in my instagram handle is austin betha you know same as my youtube channel so you might as well follow me on there and of course you get to experience whatever it is biggie has up his sleeves together okay now like i said a lot of conversations were going on in the level two mansion a lot of conversations were also going on in the level one mansion we all know that shakes is particularly excited like he's so happy to finally have groovy beside him you know so they obviously were talking and all of that before chichi and adekole had that their mini basketball well i would call it mini because i mean chichi was in her emotions so maybe we can excuse that i really don't know but i just felt like she was dealing with a lot you know just having deji move to the other house and all of that it was a lot for her and then she heard something that adekole had said you know him particularly feeling like you know whatever it is that she shared with deji was not going to last you know that the ship was not even going anywhere so why why do you now think it's okay to come and console me now that the day she has been moved to another house so she was just really in her feelings and you know adekule too i don't know he started raising his voice both of them just went off at one another you know do you think i'm afraid of you are you mad are you mad like housemates literally had to come and hold them you know just so that they don't get into anything physical Who
what a way to welcome a new housemate because this guy had barely spent how many minutes in people's house and you're already having this amount of altercation but you know again feelings were involved so i would not particularly want to judge that and say oh this person was right or this person was wrong because again it was a lot i was in my feelings as well so i'm going to excuse whatever it is that happened between adekunle and chichi okay but guys let me tell you i just feel like right now the game just began so for fina it's like if groovy goes to that level one house and decides to move to another housemate or better still decides to go to chomzy because we all know how groovy feels towards chomzy you know so according to fina if he goes back to chomzy she will go back to him swag like that's on period okay at the end of the day it's a game and then she was obviously telling her that look it might not be as easy as you you are even saying it because the truth is chi chi likes groovy chomzy likes groovy so there's a chance that chi chi would not let chomzy move to groovy so it's just like okay we need to pay attention to the level one mansion because a lot is going to happen there okay, so at this point yeah i really don't know i know there's a lot of unrest in the level one house elo swag for one is not happy because he knows that there's going to be a rivalry you know between him and chomzy because of course there's groovy and it's almost like you know chomzy likes groovy there was even a conversation chomzy was having with chi chi alongside bella shags Rachel was there as well. They had it really late in the night, you know. They were talking about this whole groovy situation. And Chichi was like, it seems like you actually like groovy more. So all the advice we'll be giving you, you probably will not take it. So if you feel like you need to have more conversations with the groovy, you know, now you get to see him every day. Bella was like, at least you get to see him wake up. You know, he might not even be as cool as you've been thinking. So this is your chance to actually study the guy and see if that's actually the person you want to be with instead of Elu Swags. And Chichi was like, you know what, maybe we should talk to Dotto to give him space so that he can sleep beside Chomzi so that they get a chance to talk and all of that. And Chomzi's like, No, I already told you people, I'm for the streets, I'm for no one, blah 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 blah. No, you should not stress yourself about him coming to my bed. Mm -mm, I say, Madam, then they try help your destiny now. You did that, they do shakara. You did that, they do shakara. So now you know. That's what she's doing does not make her a saint or anything. You know, wanting to act like I'm for the street, I'm for the street. It doesn't make you a better person. If you like the guy, you better call up with the guy and see if you know they waste time. If you know, don't talk and say, if Groovy mistakenly say, okay, now Chomzy you want now, she go go for Elu Swag. So Chomzy, you better help yourself so that you will not lose her because Fina not comment to carry last. Mm -mm. She not comment to carry last. So I don't know what's going to happen. I'm just going to pay close attention to these people and just all the drama that will unfold in that house. Okay, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section. Did you feel a certain way just seeing how Groovy and Deji have been talking to the other housemates about the things that have been happening in their houses? Do you think that they could have probably kept quiet for a day or two, you know, before downloading? I mean, Deji was just downloading left, right, center. Hmm. Now nah, what? Nah, nah. Okay, but just let me know what you think in the comment section. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.